Welcome back, Legendary Potato here. Today I wanted to show you guys probably my worst minigame I have probably ever made on Minecraft console editions. So this is going to be me kind of looking back at it for the first time in years and kind of showing you guys exactly what this is and just why it's so bad. But anyways, if you guys do enjoy this video, make sure you do leave a like on, but let's get right into it. So as you can see here, uh, this is pretty much supposed to be a Hunger Games. You're like, oh, okay, so it looks pretty standard to me. You got your chest here uh, with some random loot, got some stuff going on there. Uh, ooh, there's a golden apple in there? Okay, there's golden apples in those. Oh, there's a lot of golden apples. Uh, but anyway, it doesn't matter. The chests don't matter. Uh, what it is, is a Hunger Games, but it's got even more of a, a twist to it, which you'll see. But uh, as you can see here, is that uh, there's uh, like five pods? That, that doesn't even make much sense, but there's five pods there. And uh, we're on top of a mountain, which is a, a very weird place to, to pick where to start this, but... Anyways, as you look around, as you can see, it's a normally generated world, and uh, so what exactly is going- there's a bonus chest over here as well, what's in here? That's just some wooden stuff. Uh, but anyway, so as you can see, there's a house in the distance. Now that's actually because uh, this uh, world was pretty much put into creative mode, uh, and it was my old survival world, and I pretty much put this in a creative mode, uh, or just like a copy of this world, not the exact one, but a copy of the world, into creative mode, and then made some sort of Hunger Games out of it, and so that's pretty much the idea, the whole concept of it, so as you can see, there's my house down there, so I'm gonna go fly down there, uh, so we can go take a trip down memory lane, but as you can see, here's just like a bridge over the river, and then, wow, that was really cool, I like that, Alicia flight uh, but anyways we're at the house now so you've probably seen this before if you've seen some uh, other videos of mine then you've probably seen the survival world before uh, but I'm not gonna tour it if you want to do see that world uh, then I'll, I'll be sure to put a card on the screen to link that so you guys can see that uh, but anyways so pretty much I tried to turn this world into a Hunger Games and you could come inside the house and uh, there's bedrock on the top of the chest cuz I didn't feel like emptying them I wanted to keep everything pretty much identical I, I don't know why the wolves are here. I guess if I was playing this map, it wouldn't be very fair. Uh, but, yeah, as you can see, all my loot just kind of covered that up, I guess. So I just covered up everything. I left that. So I left some stuff the same. So it's like, oh, you can still get that. But some things I just covered up so you can't go in the... Or I guess I have the nether portal. The nether portal is fine, but it's all broken and weird and stuff. What's this? Oh, yeah. See, like, that's covered up for a reason. So I left everything the same. But I just turned it into Hunger Games, and I think this is a really, really weird idea, and I don't know why I did it. Uh, but as you can see, there's like my beds. I don't know why there's beds, honestly, that probably breaks the map too. You sleep in a bed in Hunger Games, that doesn't really make much sense. And then, there's supposed to be a mine in here. Yes, it's a mine. Uh, so pretty much, right here, I just kind of covered this up really quickly. And isn't there a room here? There's a room here, which I seem to have covered up as well. Yeah, I just completely covered up this place, so you can't even come down here, so... It's just pretty much a storage area. It's pretty bad. There's some watermelon stuff like that. But uh, I don't even know if there's chests around the rest of the world. I don't really even know at all. Uh, but all I know is that there's that house there with stuff. And if I set it today now, we can set it today. There we go. But yeah, it's just like, I just did that. And it doesn't even seem like the rest of the world even has chests. So if you want to go ahead and get stuff, then... I guess you're you're out of luck and then there's also this weird chunk I don't know exactly what happened here but it was kind of a weird chunk again I show that all off in my like survival uh, world tour which again it was it was on the screen before uh, but yeah this is the survival right here that turned into a Hunger Games and so I don't think I ever played this maybe I played it once uh, but honestly though it's just kind of kind of ridiculous what this was supposed to be and just like the entire world is completely normal if I just kind of come over here this village over there it looks like uh, but I haven't played on this world in ages it's so old it is so old but everything's left the same like I, I must have like piled with like cobblestone around here and done all this like look at all this all really nostalgic to me uh, but completely normal survival world turned into a Hunger Games like the idea was a good idea but the execution was probably awful so don't do this, don't make this mistake, or if you're going to try something like this, don't do it the way I did it, because it was a really bad idea. Uh, but anyways, that's pretty much, I think, everything to see. I've just looked at this for the first time and kind of did a live reaction to it. Uh, so I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, leave a like on it, subscribe if you're new, so you don't miss content like this every single day. But I'll see you guys in the next video, so have a good one, guys, and I'll see you guys next time.